Hey guys, welcome back to Pokemon Fire Red Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode we uh, got our starter Pokemon, which was a Gloom, and we had a really, really close uh, first battle with our rival. And uh, before we start this off, I'm going to remember to take this to the store that Gloom was actually holding. Also, I just... this as well. Finally, get... nope, not that. There we go. Tech speed on fast. Now, let's uh, head right out here and see what the first... the first few wild Pokemon are going to run into is. Now, since I don't have Pokeballs yet, this... these first encounters will not, like, count towards my Nuzlocke. I can still come back to this route and catch the first Pokemon I run into once I get Pokeballs. But, this is still going to be interesting to see what we're going to run into, so let's do this. Nothing yet. Well, let's get a potion from this guy. Gonna need as many, to try and keep as many potions, antidotes and everything on us as at all times in this game. Come on. Let's, no, let's see my first weapon. Okay, here we go. What is it? It's a... Oh, it's a Pumbloom! I mean a Whismur. Oh wow, that's interesting. Let's, uh, let's just absorb this and get ourselves some experience. Get ourselves some up a few levels. Ah, pound. Good thing about uh, a Gloom here is having the move absorb. As long as we run into Pokemon that, that will do decent damage to, we won't uh, we won't ever take too much damage. Oh god, nearly went up levels that, that was awesome. That's another kind of cool thing about this Nuzlocke uh, randomizer. Because since some of the wild Pokemon at the beginning are random, um, you can get a lot of experience from them. Because it's not just like Pidgeys and stuff. Oh, it's another Wisma. Come on, give me something different. Game. Well, just, let's just absorb this. Get ourselves up another level. See if we learn any new attacks. Now, the re one of the reasons I chose Gloom as my starter is I realised that um, the first gem is ground rocks, the second gem is water, and the third gem is electric. So Gloom is going to be very, very useful for the first three gems of the game. If, if, if she stays alive that long. And I keep calling her Gloom, I should call her Lani, that's her name. Okay, Lani, grew up a level. Level 7 Lani. Lani? Nope. <laughs> oh well. I'm pretty, I don't think Gloom actually learns too many attacks. Um, going up those fields. Oh my god! A wild onyx, that's awesome. Ah, that would be pretty cool to have. Well, let's hope we actually run into Wismar. No, Wismar. <laughs> Why did I say Wismar? It's clearly an onyx. And let's hope that when we come back here, onyx is one of the ones we run into. That would be awesome to have an onyx. Okay. Okay, we're in Virgin City. Let's, uh... Go to the Pokemon Center first and heal. Now, this is one of the let's let's speak about the Pokemon Center a little bit here. Now, one of the one of the rules that you can have in Nuzlocke challenges, which makes it more difficult, is that one of the one of the rules is to make it that you can only visit a Pokemon Center once per city. So once you enter the city, you can heal, and then you're never allowed to use that Pokemon Center again. So that is like an extremely difficult rule to have on the Nuzlocke challenge. If you're looking to make your Nuzlocke challenge a little more difficult, that's one of the ones you can put on it. Makes it extremely hard to only be able to use a Pokemon Center once per city. Especially if you want to do some grinding. You're not going to have much choice, you're going to have to spend all your money on a whole bunch of potions and stuff to try and make sure that your Pokemon will stay alive. Now, got looks partial, so let's head back. And we can get ourselves some Pokeballs and start catching, start catching some Pokemon, guys. Oh, and it's a uh, Wismar. Looks like um, it looks like this this route has replaced Pidgey and Rattata with a uh, with Wismar and Onix. So that's pretty cool. It's pretty awesome. Oh, critical hit! There we go. Come on, Lanny. Getting those crits. Um, oh god. It's going to be quite difficult to catch Onyx though, because that Absorb seemed to have uh, knocked it out in one hit. 
so this is going to be quite difficult. I hope we can uh, maybe just poison it. Although that will be difficult. Because if I poison it, then I might die from poisoning when I'm walking around. Oh, that's another thing. Gonna have to make sure we keep plenty of antidotes on us, guys. We do not want, especially for the upcoming forest, Viridian Forest, some, a lot of trainers with Weedles that will poison us. If we don't have enough antidotes, we may end up losing a member of our team due to poison. Which would fucking suck balls. We, I mean, we can't lose Lani because she's poison type. She can't get poisoned. So that's okay. But if we any other Pokemon we catch coming up to Viridian Forest, they might get poisoned. They might die. So we can't, we can't be having that shit. I ain't having that shit. So let's just make sure we have some antidotes before we go in there. Okay, we got the Pokedex. Awesome. That's cool. Yeah, uh, yeah. Fulfill your dream for you. Blah blah blah. Yeah, see you later, Gary. Piece of shit. Oh, you're not gonna get me a town map. Is that right? I'm just gonna. I'll just go talk to your sister and get one then. In fact, wait. Did he even give us Pokeballs, or did we have to buy them? I can't remember in this game if you actually get given balls or not. Oh yeah, you do. You give him five. That's awesome. Okay, Park Town. Let's uh, let's go get. Let's get him. You know, let's go, let's go get a map. Just just this spike guarded prick that he is. Thank you, Daisy. Okay. <clears throat> okay, guys. Let's see what's gonna happen. Our first. Our first new Pokemon, the first Pokemon we're going to catch by ourselves, is either going to be a Wisma or an Onyx. Let's see what it is. Come on, Onyx. Come on, Onyx. Oh my god! Um, I guess it's not just Onyx season Wismers. Um, okay. Well, let's try and catch this really fucking awesome, powerful Pokemon. Holy shit, I've fucking Tauros! Oh my god. Okay, that, that done decent damage. Okay, yes, kill it, thank god. Okay. Now, oh my god, I'm scared to use another uh, I'm scared to use another absorb in case it kills it. That's really 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 close. Um I don't think a Pokeball will catch it at this point though, no, I'm gonna have to probably risk using absorb. Come on, don't kill it, don't kill it, don't kill it. Come on. Oh my god, that's so close. Oh my god. You just keep tail whiffing me, Taurus. That's fine with me. Okay, come on, come on. Pokeball. Let's see if we got this. Come on, don't be a bitch. Oh, come on. Oh, I really want to catch this Taurus. That would be so awesome. Come on. Guess just stay in the ball, you bull fuck. Come on. One. Oh my god, really? Stop! No, stop! Please stop tail whiffing me. It's just good. This is if this. Oh my god! No, I'm just gonna see what happens. He's gonna break out of all these balls. Then he's gonna do something like horn attack or some shit because my defense is so it's gonna kill me in like one attack. Oh my fucking god! Oh god! Ooh. Okay, that wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. I thought that would do a lot more damage because of those tail whips. Just stay in the goddamn ball, Taurus. Come on! Oh my god! He keeps breaking out at one. What the hell? Am I gonna r I'm gonna run out of Pokeballs and not be able to get him. This is my last chance. He's gonna break. He's broken out of every single one. Oh come on, really? Is this like glitched or something? Like he broke out of every single one. Like after one shake. What the hell's going on here? Oh god damn it. Well that's a shame. Oh, Taurus would have made such an awesome member of the team. Oh my god, that experience. Level 9. That's really, that's really a shame. Well, you want some, you lose some, guys. Not, not a great start. This isn't a great start to our log. We nearly lost our first battle. And we, uh, we didn't catch the first Pokemon that we ran into. That's, uh, not a good start. <laughs> well... I guess all I can do is go to Viridian City, buy some more Pokeballs and hope that I can go to diff some different routes and catch something. That was that was strange though, right? I mean, he broke out after every single every single ball. After the first shake, he broke out. That's like so strange. 
Uh, let's just run away from this. We're, we're level 9, that's, that's decent. We've leveled up a few. Um, oh god, I, I, you know, I'm really going to need to catch a new Pokemon as well, because otherwise Lani's going to have a lot of trouble ca getting through Viridian Forest. Because uh, every trainer in there has bug and poison types. So, I mean, what the hell are we going to do? I mean, we've only got Absorb, you know? If, if, unless Lani wants to learn the move Acid or something anytime soon. We're screwed. We need to catch another Pokemon before Viridian Forest, otherwise we're gonna just We're gonna be screwed. We're not gonna we're gonna be in there forever. It's gonna be a pain in the ass. Oh hey Onyx. Again. Let's just uh let's just absorb. We can we can kill Onyx pretty quick and get some good XP. Let's just absorb it. Okay. No. See, uh, if only if only Lani had sleep powder right now, we would have been able to catch that Taurus probably a lot easier. But oh well. Let's just heal and then we'll go some we'll go buy some balls and then we'll go uh we'll go we'll go west. <coughs> uh we'll go west and uh see if there's not a Pokemon over there we can catch. And uh, hopefully this time it won't be something that's just going to break out after after one shake every time. That was god damn, it's so strange. Well, you know, I guess Tauros probably has probably has quite a high catch rate. So let's uh, you know what? Let's uh, just cause just cause we have it and we don't really need it at this point. Let's sell this full restore. Yeah, fifteen hundred, fifteen hundred dollars for it. We don't need that. We don't need a full restore. We can have just some potions on us. Okay, so let's buy some, uh, let's buy, oh, I don't know how many balls, let's buy 10, That's, that, should be, that should be enough to catch a couple of guys, uh, let's get some potions, let's get some, now we'll get 5 potions, and uh, we'll get some antidotes as well, not that many, we don't need that many, we'll get like 5 antidotes, there we go, just for those damn weedles and their poison sting that will always poisons you, okay, now, I don't want to end the video here. I want to see. I want to try and catch a new Pokemon for our team before this part ends. So let's go over here and let's hope, guys. Let's really hope we can catch our first Pokemon. Okay. What's it going to be? What's it going to be? What's it going to be? Come on, something awesome, but not too hard to catch. Oh, what is it? A Raticate. A fucking Raticate. Ah. Uh. I mean, it's not the worst thing in the world, but I was hoping for something not so common. I mean, you see Rat, you would see Rat attacks here normally. Screw it! Oh god, quick attack. No. Let's, uh, let's try and catch this. He can be the first member of our team, why not? Rat is okay, so he's, he's decent, you know, he's got decent speed and attack stuff. He can learn some kill moves. He can learn some kill attacks, let's uh... And he's level 4, I mean, that's pretty cool. So let's uh, let's catch this, this mofo. No, take what? Okay, now you don't be a bitch like Tauros was. Stay in the goddamn ball. Come on, come on, come on. Yes! Rattle was caught. Yeah. First new member of the team, guys. A racket. Oh. Okay. Who's going to be named after Rackate? <laughs> this will be interesting. Um, you know what? Since he's so, since he's so small, and uh, I think it would be pretty funny. Let's uh, let's uh, go with Hobbit. We'll name Rackate Hobbit. That'll, that'll be fun. <laughs> What's he got? Let's see, let's see what he's got. Any items? No. Oh, adamant nature. Wow, that's awesome. That's really awesome. That's right, maybe actually may actually be pretty good. You know, adamant nature, he's got some pretty strong attack. He may be a great member of the team, guys. You know, you never know. Well, you know what? I think that's enough for part two here. We've, uh, you know, we got up to Virgin City and stuff. We caught our first Pokemon, Rackate, or uh, Hobbit. <laughs> and uh, that's awesome. So, thanks for watching, guys. 
Uh, if you like this video, subscribe to, to see more. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.